Hello everyone, Free the Prinnies here. Welcome back for another episode of Let's Play Mother 3. In the last episode, we found out that Klaus has ran after that Drago. So now we have to go stop him before he ends up like his mother. So, let's go ahead and head through the woods to Alex's house. Just in case you didn't know, Alex's house is right up there. So we got a bit of a ways to travel here. So, let's go ahead and get through this. What are you? Ow. Oh. An enemy, of course. Literally, a praying mantis. And flicked him away. One shot. Nice. Wow. Well, and there was a nut in there. Great. We're gonna be picking up all sorts of interesting items today, aren't we? Hey, what are you? Come here. Not a flying mouse. A greedy mouse, huh? He hid the food he was carrying. Well, I'm gonna get it from you anyways. Gotcha. Give me that food. What are you hiding? Alright, Flint gets to level 12. That's nice. Alright, let's go ahead and run through some of these bad guys here. Now, yep, getting blocked by the greedy mice. Ow. Get out of here. That's for biting me, you fool. Get that sweet, sweet experience, though, right? Come here, Mr. Mouse. Guess I should try going for the uh, surprise attacks on these guys. Oh, well, that was a waste. I haven't even damaged him yet. And he's out of here. That level up really came in handy. What did he leave behind? Oh, of course. Should have guessed. Nut bread. Would have thought it would have been peculiar cheese. Alright, let's see. Well. Might as well fight some of these guys. Wow, still can't finish him off in one shot, though, huh? Ow, he actually got an attack on him. Get out of here, Mr. Yam yeah Monster. Oh, hey. Hey, baked yam. Nice. Finally, something that's not. Nut bread. If I remember correctly, yeah, it actually heals 40 instead. That's pretty nice. Let's go ahead and use one of these nut breads, I suppose. And we're not going to really need these nuts, so I'm just going to go ahead and drop that. Got to have some space for some items here. That's one of the unfortunate things about this game, is that inventory space at the beginning is going to be sorely lacking. So, ah, couldn't coil around me, buddy. Yeah, without Boney here, though, these uh, snakes will actually get the drop on me, so... Well, I can take an antidote, just in case one of them poisons me. Is this another flying mouse? Sure is. Let's go ahead and deal some physical damage to him. Oh yeah, you can't do anything anymore. Yeah, see, not enough to finish him in one shot, though. Oh, that did it. Get out of here, Mr. Mouse. Yeah, see, the experience is still so nice in the area, though. I think we need to just carry on. Run, 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 run. Aha. He'll never take me alive. Alright, what do we got going on here? Oh, that was the way to Lighter's house. Lighter and Fuel's house. We don't need to go that way. So let's do a little bit of backtracking here. Run past all these guys. Touch the Bakey M monster. Why not? Go ahead and deal with this guy. I actually think if you get back attacks, you might actually do more damage to them. So that's kind of nice. Yam yeah, monsters are easy to get back attacks on, too. Alright. Baked yams. Better than nut bread, technically. Alright. Oh, don't touch me. Ah, oh, man. Got me. Alright, buddy. Fine. We'll go ahead and deal with uh, this guy. Everything in this forest is out to get me. Ow. Ow. I like how it says when you beat things, they become tame, too. It's like we're not actually killing them. We're just beating them into submission, apparently. Alright, let's go this way. Yeah, and get charged by a bitey snake. But luckily we got the back attack on it, so... Easy to deal with. 
Let's see, are we on the right track? Yes, we are. I love being able to dash, but the problem with being able to dash is that you can run into enemies a lot easier. Although, in certain situations, we don't have much of a choice but to run into them. So. Alright, Mr. Bitey Snake. Well, thankfully, it didn't poison us, so that's always good. Although, we got plenty of antidotes, so... Yeah, we've seen enough of these forest critters. Aha! Your slowdown wasn't enough for me. What is this? Oh, an enemy! A walking bushy, huh? What is this, Fortnite or something? Oh, well, well let's go ahead and deal with this guy. Life up. Oh, he's got healing. Oh! Well, he healed me. I feel kind of bad for beating the crap out of him now. Generated fresh air. Oh, boy. Am I, am I the monster here? Yeah, eight experience points. Well, thanks, Bushy. Oh, what are you? What are these guys? Spud bugs. Huh. Well, I guess we could try to swing our way through these guys here, huh? I don't know how effective this will be. Well, that seems to do a decent chunk of damage. Go ahead and do that again. There we go. Should be able to beat all of them in just a couple swings, then. That's good. Huh. Well, it's nice to see some new enemies in the area. Alright, and we reached level 13. A running bomb, huh? Yeah, sure, why not? Get rid of some nut bread, huh? Yeah. Take a running bomb. Sounds like fun. Alright, you got anything going on up here? Tree's out of the way, so we can go a little bit further. Hello, Mr. Frog. Oh, hey there! Go ahead and save your game. Thank you, sir. Oh, no problem. Be careful out there. Lots of dangerous things up ahead. Thank you, Mr. Save Frog. Oh, what is this? Ah, is it a boar? An agitated boar, huh? All right, well, kicking the ground, huh? This next attack might hurt. Yep, ow. Yeah, that does quite a decent chunk of damage. If it connects. Oh, beef jerky, huh? Oh, uh, yeah, actually, why not? I think we'll throw away one of those antidotes. Yeah, I don't know if we'll be encountering too many bitey snakes ahead. Beef jerky is actually one of the better healing items this early in the game, too. Oh, boy. Yeah, why not? Come here, Mr. Boar. Ah, caught you. Had to give chase. Oh, charging already, huh? Oh boy, this is gonna hurt. Phew. Wow, the boars are pretty tough in the area, that's for sure. Well, luckily for us, we're getting a lot of beef jerky, so... And I think we'll go ahead and throw away a nut bread this time. Don't get me wrong, I'm... I love nut bread as much as the next person. Matter of fact, it might not be a bad idea to heal up, so how about we go ahead and use some of that nut bread? There we go. Yeah, plus we got baked yams, so we might as well top ourselves up. Alright, anything else over this way, actually? Oh, hey, there's an item. Beef jerky. Okay, cool. Now we're starting to get better items. Alright, let's carry on up ahead here. There's a lot of... Oh, slash marks in the area. What are you? The mischievous mole, huh? We're back again, are you? And he fell over instantly, huh? Dealt with him pretty easily. Really? You guys are all over the place, huh? I will deal with you all the same. Anybody else want to jump out of the ground and try to attack me? I would hope not. What? The rocks are alive, too? Oh, it's a crag lizard. Oh, he's gonna be tough to beat, huh? 
Well, at least it doesn't hurt too bad so far. Oh yeah, he's tough. He bore down in the tags, huh? Now, Please die, Mr. Crag Lizard. There we go. Wow, he was tough. A lot of experience points, though. What were you, Guardian? An Aquarius bracelet, huh? Well, let's go ahead and take a look at what that does. Pumps my defense up another two points. Nice. And after that battle, why don't we go ahead and chow down on some nut bread real quick, just to get our health a little back up. Gotta be careful of those crag lizards. Apparently those guys are pretty strong, so... Alright, Mr. Mischievous Mole here. Why don't you throw at me a rock? Alright, you're gonna pay for that, buddy. Yeah, get out of here. Let me guess, nut bread, huh? Well, can't say no to nut bread. I don't know, two crag lizards at the same time? I don't know if I'm feeling particularly good about that. Well, there's no getting around it, it looks like. Oh, well, they're attacking one at a time. How about we try one of them running bombs that we have? Let's see what that does, huh? There we go. Go ahead and throw that bomb at the crag lizard. Oh, nice. Does quite a lot of damage. Would have been nice if both of them would have fought me at the same time. Aha, sucker. Gila Pass. Wait, what did that sign say? Excuse me, Mr. Crag Lizard. Please come over this way. Thank you. Stay away. Okay, well, the sign says stay away. I guess we'll stay away for now. Not gonna bother with that other Crag Lizard. Probably a good idea to stay away from Aguila Pass for now. Alright. Are we finally here? And sure enough, we are. Nice. We've made it. This place looks awfully familiar. Hey, Mr. Mouse, you weren't here before. Oh, yeah, well... Anything in the trash can this time? SOS? Morse code, huh? What are you doing Morse code for? Oh, well. Let's go talk to Alec. He should be in here, right? Hey, Alec. I came just as you instructed. Yeah, the animals are getting pretty crazy out there. Yeah, you gotta be careful of those guys. Where'd he go? Ah, the Kermit the Frog Intelligence. The friend's house. Alright, well, who's your friend? Guess we're gonna find out here. Alex joined the group. Anything going on up here? Let's go take a look real quick. Nothing, huh? Can I rest up in the bed? Oh boy. Oh boy. Is it a box down here? What's in there? Nope, nothing. No problem here, apparently. Alright, well, let's go ahead and see whose friend he's talking about. Where's this friend of yours? Ow. Oh, you're friends with the frogs, huh? And lizards, too? What a lizard. Ow. Oh. He wasn't there a minute ago. He's an oddly shaped fellow. Hello. What is this? Arrow lizards? The friends are called mad gypsies, huh? Hmm. Well, I trust you. What is this? I'm a lizard. Well, he's an arrow lizard. Alright, well, point us in the direction, buddy. Where he stops, nobody knows. Oh, down this way, huh? Okay, ow, straight into a cactus, you fool. He's tricked us. Okay, so... Oh, hello, arrow lizard. Okay, go ahead and spin around. I mean, he was pretty much pointing the way we needed to go, so... Let's just carry on in that direction. Oh, down this way. Yes, Alec? I mean, I was sprinting, but yes, you do have... You have piqued my curiosity a little bit. Oh, okay. Neither man nor woman, huh? So they're like mystical beings? Well, that's good, at least. But we 
kind of should hurry up. Yep. And unfortunately, if they touch Alec, they will fight you too. So, I'm gonna get pelted by a rock. Alright, mischievous mole. Time to meet your maker. Alright, level 14, huh? Nice. And of course, I'll take that nut bread. Why not at this point? Okay, arrow lizard's pointing this way. Wait a minute. Can't go that way, arrow lizard. Did I make a wrong turn in Albuquerque? Nope. Apparently we are going down. Oh boy. Hello, Mr. Arrow Lizard. Now which way are we going this time? Hmm, this way, huh? Oh, froggies. Hello. Wrong. I am the wrong frog. Oh, okay. So you're the right frog. You're literally the right frog. Oh. Hello. Oh, Kermit the Frog here, ready to help you. On your journey, watch us build a bridge for you. Oh, okay. Well, that's kind of nifty. Oh, oh boy. I feel kind of bad stomping on him like this. Starting to get Mario RPG vibes. Oh, boy. Well, now that we've gotten across that bridge, are we going to find out about who these Majipsies are? I think we'll have to wait till the next episode to figure out who they are, though. So, stay tuned, everybody, and Pretty Squad, we will see you in the next one. Later.